Oh, my name's Sam, I'm a podiatrist here, and uh, I have been here for over 10 years. Before I did podiatry, I did a degree in anatomy and physiology, and I was actually thinking about going down the chiropractic pathway. Uh, and then I had a problem with my foot, and I actually ended up at a podiatry clinic, and uh, I was just really fascinated with the process and, and how he got me moving again, and I thought, well, if we're gonna talk about alignment, we better start from the ground up. So yeah, that's how I ended up in podiatry. I think it's the ability just to help people. Like it's, you know, people come in, like they might be um, having trouble even just going to work. So they've got foot pain, they know they've got to get up and go to work and it's a struggle. And um, like I really enjoy like helping those people. It's, it's a simple thing. Uh, you get them happy, you get them moving, they can go to work and earn a living. So that, that's why I really get a kick out of that. Yeah, look, there's, there's actually so many, it's hard to pick one. An example was we had a lady come in and she was running. Uh, she was running with her husband. Um, they were doing it as a, as a fitness thing together. They wanted to do it together. Uh, she was really struggling. Um, we looked at her shoes, her shoes were okay. We looked at her feet and her feet were actually pretty good as well. Uh, but when we looked at her run, there was, there was something not quite right. So it turned out she wasn't using her legs as good as she could. She wasn't using her glutes. So we actually did some work on her running technique. Uh, and she came back a few times, we, we checked it a few times. And in the end, she came in a big smile on her face and she was beating her husband. So she was, she was chuffed. So yeah, that was good. What, what we do here, like we're dealing with uh, foot mechanics, but of course that can be dictated by the leg mechanics, how they're holding their core, um, there's so much to it. So it's kind of an overlap between podiatry, uh, physiotherapy, occupational therapy, um, yeah, uh, exercise physiology, like they all kind of blend together in some ways. So uh, pretty much anything to do with movement from, from there down we, we deal with, yeah. Oh, it's, it's awesome, yeah. I mean, I've been here for 10 years and I've seen people come and, and they don't usually go. They, they stay, they go away, have kids, come back. So, yeah, it, it's great. Well, I think we're all basically friends as, as well as colleagues. I mean, we don't necessarily all hang out after work, but we're definitely friends. So it's a team. It's, it's that team environment. So you, know, you can stick your head down the hallway and ask for help and... Yeah, it's good like that. I, it sounds a bit corny, but I feel privileged because um, when, I, when I started here, we were in the little house next door. Um, we used to have um, like plastic chairs in the waiting room. Uh, we had one treadmill, we had one camera, uh, and, and just through Troy's drive to, to get the best, we've got state-of-the-art treadmills and cameras. We've got this, this massive sp space that, that just allows me to do the job. We've, we've always had the best. Troy's always pushed for that. It makes my life so easy uh, as a dietarist. Like, um, I don't have to guess, so yeah, I really like that. Well, we hope that they know that we've, we're here to, to get them to their best. Like, um, the vision is to, for people to reach their potential, and like, it, that's that's what it's about. I mean, it's you want the patients to get over their problem and do what they want to do, and um, that's what we try to help them with.